In this tutorial, we're going to walk through how to trim in the V direction on a body type component. Now, if we jump to a front view and zoom in a little bit, we'll more easily see the behavior that's going to happen here. Now, note that we have access to a V1 and V2 trimming option, and that means that we can do this twice. So if we turn on trim V1, notice how you have a starting position at 75% around the surface of this model, and it goes up to this position that we've set here at round about, say, 90%. If we turn this off and go from the other direction, we've gone from some small positive value here, and we come around to this 25% position. So notice that we can move this, and it's going around the surface of this geometry. And again, what it's doing is it's beginning the trimming at this first value and stopping the trimming at this second value. But unlike in the U direction, you can absolutely switch these. So if you go past, it's going to start trimming here at the 25% position, and it's going to trim around from the other direction and come here. So these can absolutely flip, and the behavior will be slightly different depending on whether you're greater than or less than in this case. Now, if you have both of these turned on at the same time, you can, of course, adjust to have a trim from one side and another, so you can clip away multiple little regions in between here. But I want to emphasize that this isn't just a clean, straight, chamfered cut all the way back. What this is doing is it's trimming to a certain curve along the surface of this body, and it has a second trimmed curve, and it's lofting straight lines in between each of those as you move back. So it's going to try its best to maintain a constant directional line between this point and this point all along these curves. So if we get a little bit of perspective here, notice that this length here is different than this length is different than this length. And that behavior follows the same pattern regardless of whether it's a wing type conformal geometry or a body type geometry.